Hi, I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to join me. My name is Karen Wolfson, and I'm your stenograph representative. Today, I'll be covering how easy it is to use Briefit on your Luminex. Briefit is a translation feature that's built into the Luminex, and it suggests conflict-free brief forms for words and phrases that you write during a job. When you write the same three or more steno strokes more than once, the Luminex generates a brief form and displays it in the Briefit pane. The Luminex looks at your Luminex dictionary and it makes sure that the suggestions provided will not conflict with anything that is already in your Luminex dictionary. If you use Briefit on the Luminex and on your CAT system, the suggested briefs may not match. Therefore, Stenograph recommends against using the Luminex Briefit feature during real time. To activate Briefit on your Luminex, simply turn the Luminex on select Setup, then select Translation Options. It's actually abbreviated and it just says Trans Op. Next, use the down arrow to highlight the Use Briefit option. Select the On Off to turn it on, and it will display a Yes next to the Use Briefit option. Use the down arrow to highlight the Write Twice to Define option. Next, select the On Off so that it displays a Yes next to the Write Twice to Define option. Use the down arrow to highlight the only suggest one stroke briefs. If you only want one stroke suggestions, then set this to yes. Otherwise, if you want to see all the suggestions, then set it to no. Next, select OK, and now you're beginning, now you're ready to begin using Briefit. You can either just start writing, or if you wanted to select more and then quit, the machine will remember the settings and it will remember that Briefit is activated, so the next time you turn it on, the Briefit will be active. In fact, it will remain active until you go back in and turn it off. When Briefit is active, the Luminex defaults to the Briefit view when you begin writing. Text shows on the left side of the screen and the Briefit pane is on the right. The most recent brief always displays at the bottom of the Briefit list. To use a suggested brief, just write it twice so that Briefit creates a JDefine. All subsequent uses of the brief only need to be written once. I really appreciate your time in listening to this, and the goal was simply to introduce Briefit, but there are additional features and information that can be used with Briefit, and this can be found in the Luminex User's Guide. Otherwise, feel free to contact our technical support for any additional help. I hope you found this short video to be useful, and thank you again for taking time to join me today.